Hey guys, this is Dream Deal here and today I have another tutorial that can be pretty useful if you have a motor pad that got broken by a crash or simply got them. So on this tutorial I'm gonna show you to how to you can change one of your motor or main motor pads. In this case we're using the mixer quad X, so it goes to one for four and changes to motor pads that you may have on your FC that five or six. This is pretty simple. You ha just have to know what your, your what commands you're going to use. Uh, so let's let's go. Okay, in CLI you want to load your mixer. As I've pre previously said, it's a quad X, mine and yours uh, maybe as well. And you want to put the command mmix load. In this case, my mixer is quad X, so I'm gonna load this one. Now you can see that you have some parameters that appeared here and I'm going to explain it to you. Uh, the M mix 0 to 3, it's your motor pad 1 to 4. So mo motor pad 1 is your M mix 0. So let's say that you want to change your motor 1, you want to change the uh, M mix 0. Or if you want to change your motor 3, you want to change M mix 2. That's how it is. I don't know why. Okay. Next, so let's imagine we want to change motor 2 to path 5, so mx1 to mx4, it doesn't appear now but it's going to be that. Uh, as you can see mx1, it's uh, in front of that you have some parameters that are different for, from all the other motors, so you can see mx1 is 1 min minus 1 minus 1, 1, and motor 3 four in this case is one one minus, minus one one minus one so this is some index that uh, tell you that mmx1 it's the that kind of parameters so what you want to do it's copy the to mmx4 in this case if i'm putting on motor 5 the parameters on mmx1 a lot of talk but in practical it's 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 simple you're gonna see so let's say I want to put my motor 1 on my path 5 or motor 5 output. Uh, you have to put on the mx command mx 5, uh, 4 in this case, this is motor 5, uh, the parameters of your motor 2. In this case, it's 1, minus 1, minus 1, and 1. As you can see in front of mx 1, that's the parameters that uh, it, it has. In this case, you'll see appearing mx1, minus 1, minus 1, and 1. So now, path 5, in this case mx4, has the uh, same parameters of your path 2, of uh, the motor 2, in this case mx1. But you can have the both, both of them activated, so you want to 0 mx1. In this case, you put mx1, and then you put 1, and following the zeroing of the last three uh, parameters and you can see here that it's now zeroed but you're wondering uh, I can see MX5 right uh, how can I at least see it this can be useful if you don't if you want to put on pipe path 6 uh, the, the command the program will not show you path 6 since it's not next to part 3. I don't know why, uh, maybe on future versions I will show, but if you want to put like a dummy line on this one, you have to put just simply MX5 and as you did to zero out the other, the MX1, just put this one and now you can see that MX5 appears zero and MX2 appears zero. All the other ones are activated, right? Simple. Now, you're pretty much done, but for you have to want to save this custom mix that you're making. So, as you can see, you're, you're using the mixer quad X. You don't want this on mixer quad X. You want this on your custom mix. So you just simply put mixer custom, and that will save you the the mixer that this mix. So I just uh, I just disabled motor two and put it on my path five pretty simple so this can save you uh, yeah and don't forget to hit save 
and you have your custom uh, custom made path on your FC as you can see it doesn't show any image because it's custom but now with this your other paths are activated and so you can use your FC for a little while until it goes da da so that's done I hope this video was clear to you if you have any other um, doubts about this comment share and subscribe if you like if you want more and if you have any more ideas that you want me to talk about just say it and i will try and make it as simple as i can and thanks for my thanks for seeing my videos and have a good one